100 young men and women between the ages of 18 and 35 will have the opportunity to learn how to operate heavy machinery, such as bulldozers, excavators, and dump trucks. The initiative is part of the Ministry of Youth Development and National Services Alternative Learning and Life Skills Enhancement Training, or ALSET, program. Delivering the feature address at the launch of the program, Line Minister Foster Cummings said the ministry will continue to prioritize the development of young people, but he encouraged them to take advantage of these opportunities. But if you really want to improve yourself and get some quality jobs, you have to equip yourself. You have to upskill. You have to be able to attract the kind of salary that you want to attract. So we are saying to young people, there is no easy way out really. Take some time, train yourself, equip yourself so that you can make the kind of dollars you want to make in a legal way. The ministry has partnered with the NESC Technical Institute to administer the program. President of NESC, Kern Das, said students should never underestimate the power of skills training as it is necessary and very important. He revealed that in partnership with this country, Guyana recently graduated 10 instructors in heavy tea certification with international standards. So I want to tell you that even though this is a short program, consider carefully coming into a larger program because while you can operate the heavy equipment somebody needs to somebody needs to take care of it and this is a certified diploma program the ministry of education is also a partner ministry for this initiative minister in the ministry of education lisa morris julian said the ministry aims to revitalize the technical and vocational education and training skill set to afford quality TVET education to develop working practical citizens. This was born out of our national public consultation on education. It is our strategic objective to revitalize TVET through the promotion of TVET as the premier career choice for all students. It is not a third or fourth, it is the first choice. Developing an effective quality assurance framework for TVET and with our system ministry, improving the TVET certification system for career advancement. One of the participants of the previous program, Shaquille Francis, admitted that he liked the on-the-job training experience the project provided. The field experience was amazing. As we got to load the skits there, drive, drive and offload the dump truck, big trenches, with a barco, clear piece of land with a bulldozer, and stockpile with the excavator. 83 applicants successfully completed the program last year. Kimberly D'Souza, TTT News.